Hello, new friend. My name is Fred. The words you hear are in my head. I say I said my name is Fred, and I've been very naughty. The story I'm about to tell, I tell you, I will tell it well, is of my dear Aunt Muriel, and just how I've been naughty. Voila, the farm, my aunt lives here, with precious pup and husband dear. My heart beats fast as I draw near. I feel so nice and naughty. I thought just how excited they must be that I would come today. They shout, come Fred, huzzah, hooray. Dear boy, you look so naughty. That's when my tired eyes beheld a doggy dog, like dog he smelled. D-O-G is what he spelled, and that's how I spell naughty. Alone was I with tender courage, and all his fur, his furry furage, which I say did encourage me to be quite naughty. Courage, your hair, it reminds me of the first time I knew just how I felt about hair. It was a day I'd not forget, the day that I first met my pet. Oh, what a lovely gift to get, I'd never felt so naughty. My furry friend is what he was, this darling little ball of fuzz, and oh, such fuzz, such fuzz it does, demand that I be naughty. He looked at me, his fetching eyes, and fetching fur did hypnotize, and filled me with joy, and filled me with sighs, and that's when I got naughty. This dripping hair, this drooping curl, unfolds sweet memories of a girl, whose tresses, oh, they twist and twirl, and tempt me to be naughty. Barbara, my love, was named, and her hair a mane untamed, until one evening, I'm ashamed, I got a little naughty. The look upon my young love's face was sweet as lace, but in this case, I realized she needed space. I'd never more was naughty. Well, maybe not never. Dear Kerr, your fur and fleece remind of nothing found in humankind, but for one fellow who did find me to be in a certain mood. Into my shop he walked one day, with bush above and beard bouquet. That's no toupee, I pray, no way. I could help but to be, you know. I'd never seen such hair before, his bangs they sang, his neck it beckoned, eyebrows, armpits, all were reckoned. Soon I figured, what the heck, and guess how I was naughty. Sweet pooch, afraid I'll shave your tail, why not, that wouldn't be weird. So ends our little story, but then. My landlords did resume, to free me from that porcelain tomb, and ferry to a private room, your hero, ever daunty. Goodbye, dear aunt, I'll miss your farm, and in trace, ebullient charm, and farewell courage, what's the harm, if I was slightly naughty. With love.